guys! Hi guys, Gracie here, and today, no, I don't have fudge bars, but I'm doing a tutorial or something. Okay, so I have wanted a hay rack for nutmeg because right now what he does is makes a big mess with his hay, which is fine because it's what guinea pigs do, but I try, I don't know. Oh, what I'm trying to do is I want to litter in him, so I'm thinking, and a cardboard box will not do that. So, I'm thinking if I could do this and put, like, a hay rack over it, over the litter tray, then that'll work out. But anyway, today is another DIY video on how to make a hay rack with, like, a box. So, I got this from my state brothers, it's in Ramona, and, yeah. So, it's perfect size box, might be a little big, but that's okay. So you could either have it like this, or like this. I am probably going, I'm having it like this. So, yeah, you can always, um, put, like, stuff on it, and different so things. Uh, just a second. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to. So what you're going to want to do is get, like, a marker or something. Um. Um! Okay. I'm like, um! Colby, that's not used for... Uh, I can see the one! Stop. Um! Okay, so then, what you're going to do is... Here, I'll show you. I'm going to have this. Okay, so I've made a little you hole for it, but you can't really like touch it. Okay, so if you can see, I've kind of drawn on it right there. Yeah, Colby? Um, right there? Instead, you know how he has that wooden fence against our fence? Mm -hmm. There's a little space, since I saw... I heard something by the bushes, so I just went through that. Cool. And I ended up um, by the pool barrel. Okay, so anyway, the fudge. So I've drawn my little thing. It's very hard to see on here because it's not the greatest pen, but that's okay because I don't really want ink where I think it's going to be. Please, no loud noises, Colby. Why is it Kindle? Same Kindle card. Oh. I don't know, it's just do it's acting up it's been acting up weird. Mm -hmm. So then I'm just gonna take my scissors to it and kinda go along the line. I'll I'll show you guys what I mean. I'm just going on the line. So I'm trying to okay, there we go. So I just kept going like pressing hard like that on it until I made a hole. So now I'm just going to cut along the ink. Make sure that there's no ink left for your guinea pig to chew on the cardboard box and get sick. Because that would be very bad. So, just do this. And feel free to decorate it or make any shape you want. Why is my in here? Ethan was playing with it. And so, yeah. Then you can just get that twisted off of this corner piece. So now mine looks like this. Has a little hole, stuff the hay in the top. So I yes. What foot thing? You took this out. Ethan was playing with that too. I wasn't doing anything. Ethan. Um, sorry about the noise. Okay, so then I'm gonna cut the flaps off of the top. So then you just want to cut the flaps off. Now I might have a part two because, um, yeah, this might take longer than 15, well, than 14, 15 minutes because my time only can go up to 15 minutes. So, yeah. From what? Okay, so then you just want to cut all the flaps off. So the big space at the top. Okay, 
So now I've done that, and so my box looks like this so far. Then on the bottom, how it's like really loose and stuff, you can choose to duct tape it, or just to tape it. Um, I do want to duct tape it, so it it will have bright color. Where is it? Okay, my red there. Um, just a second. Let me get up into my closet. So yeah, you can just put, you can decorate it however you want. I'm just putting that flap right there with duct tape because it's not very secure and I don't want not like nibbling on it, my guinea pig, um, and like grow it. So, yeah. He won't mind if it's pink. Because I have a little bit of pink left, but then the other one I'm going to blow on. I almost tripped on my pants. Okay, so, got pink. And he won't mind. So then, dang it, this is really uneven. Um, sorry about that. It's my brother Colby. So then I'm just going to measure where it is right there. And then all I'm going to do is just cut it right there. So then I have a strip of pink. So I'm going to glue down, well, the side of it, like of the box. But then the way that I'm doing it, I, it's going to be the bottom. So I'm just going to glue that down. What are you doing? Yeah. When I just turned on my fan, apparently a slit of paper was in it. Oh. From him. <gasps> Your Kindle turned on. I know, it turns on and off. Okay, so then all I have to do is just cut these corners off now. It's working. I know it works, but I can't get on any of my games or anything. Or watch any videos on it. But yeah, if you guys know how to like fix a Kindle that has lost sound and You're on Minecraft can't right play now. any games or You're on Minecraft right now. I know, but I can't get on any worlds. It just gets me off of it. Or like how to fix sound on it. <laughs> or like um It's really easy. How to get how to be able to watch videos and play music again because my Kindle just like it's really easy blacked out. Okay, so now we're going to do it like this. I make this longer, and then let me just cut this. These are really good scissors. They cut through cardboard really easily. I don't know what brands they are, but I know they work well. Dang, I'm already up to eight minutes. So I'm probably going to have a part two. Oh yeah, and so, so far this is how it looks, and so I've got this, so now I'm just going to have a strip, and I'll show you what I'm going to do with it, so I'm just going to have it like this, but right now, oh well, and just like this, okay, so now it's pretty much covering the whole bottom, except this little part, and so... And yeah, now what I gotta do, so now I know that these parts are secure, so these are what the sides look like. You can choose to put duct tape on the sides and then going in, so that's all you can use marbles, if you sell them, they're about worth a hundred bucks. No. Um, so yeah, you can always decorate the back and stuff. I'm just gonna duct tape the sides because I've kind of already done that. So, yeah, I am going to have a part two to this video, and, yeah, I'm going to upload part two today, because, yeah, so all you have to do is just, um, put this on here, and it's kind of going over, okay, so like that, I know it doesn't cover the whole entire sign, Side, side, I meant. So then, as you can see, kind of like that. Now I'm going to do the same to the other side.
okay, that'll be good enough. So, yeah. Um, and yeah, so my Kindle, I don't know what happened. One day it just blacked out. Well, it didn't black out. I was on, I was Skyping my friend, Desi, and then just lost sound. So, I don't know. I've tried rebooting it, like holding the button for 30 seconds. That didn't work either, but that's okay. So now this is what it looks like on this side and this side. I know this side looks a little bit better. Because I have, like, a block missing here, and, like, I don't know, the sides are it. So, I am going to decorate the front and the back. But, otherwise, yeah, you've pretty much done the basics. So, I'm going to end this video right now. I'm going to have part two up just a couple minutes later, I think. So, yeah, bye, guys. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. Bye.